Top 20 Scariest Insects on Earth, Voice Over, True Story JM Written by, Mimi Kenny You wouldn't want to tangle with these dangerous bugs. For this list, we'll be looking at the most unsettling insects and arachnids found around the world. Our countdown includes Brahmin Moth Caterpillar, Goliath Beetle, Hornets, Australian Funnel Web Spider, Goliath Bird Eater, and more. Transcript Welcome to True Story JM and today we're counting down our picks for the top 20 scariest insects. For this list, we'll be looking at the most unsettling insects and arachnids found around the world. Which of these insects creeps you out the most? Let us know in the comments. Before we go on please take a moment to like this video and subscribe. Subscribe so that you don't miss out on anything. Now it's time to see and hear how dangerous these things are. If you have entomophobia, fear of insects, this may be a good time to stop listening. There are roughly 950,000 insect species on Earth, which leaves a lot of room for particularly creepy crawl eyes. In honor of Halloween, here are 20 nightmarish bugs that deserve their own creature features. Listen on, at your own risk. Number 20, Scorpion Fly. This terrifying insect certainly looks like something out of a horror movie. If their appearance isn't enough to give you nightmares, maybe this fact will, this fly's interest in human corpses have assisted scientists in human cadaver studies. Not your common fly. If you saw a scorpion fly, you might think one of the most irritating insects has bred with one of the scariest arachnids. This winged creature has a tail that resembles a scorpion's intimidating stinger. However, this is less for defense and more for romance. Scorpion flies do not sting. Their tails are actually claspers that the males use for mating. It's not an easy love life, though, as male scorpion flies have to give their female companions the right gift to not be killed. This is typically something like another dead insect for her to feast on. If you find a scorpion fly in your garden, you might be a little taken aback. But like with most insects, you have nothing to fear. Number 19 Brahmin Moth Caterpillar. This particular caterpillar resembles something altogether alien. Their tentacle-like spindles reaching up from the abdomen serve as a, likely very effective, defense mechanism. When we think of insects that give us the creeps, we tend to not think of caterpillars. That's because we're usually not thinking of the Brahmin Moth Caterpillar. The larval version of the Brahmin Moth, these caterpillars look like they came out of a horror movie. They have barbed tails and protruding appendages on their heads that are useful for camouflaging amongst branches, safe from predators. These caterpillars might not look like the friendliest insects, but have no fear, they are completely harmless. All they want is to survive and enjoy long and prosperous moth lives. Number 18, Giant Weta. Resembling a large cricket, the giant Weta species are among the largest and heaviest insects in the world. The name Weta comes from the Maori word Wetapunga, meaning God of Ugly Things. Unless you're from New Zealand, you probably have no idea what a Weta is, much less a giant one. There are actually 11 types of giant Weta, and some reach a length of about 4 inches. They look like grasshoppers from another dimension. So, it's appropriate that the genus name, Dianacrida, literally translates to terrible grasshopper. Oh, and Weta derives from Wetapunga, which, in Maori, translates to God of Ugly Things. Although these creatures are unsettling, they pose no threat, at least not to humans. During mating season, male Wetas attract mates by annihilating each other with their huge pinchers. They might not be pretty, but they're definitely powerful. Number 17 Venomous Puss Caterpillar The Brahmin Moth Caterpillar looks scary but is harmless. The Venomous Puss Caterpillar looks friendly but is extremely dangerous, which you might figure based on its name. 
these caterpillars have large coats of bristles resembling fur on fluffy mammals. But whatever you do, don't touch them. If you do, you'll likely be stung by their spines. And this isn't mild irritation, either. The pain has been described in excruciating terms, from feeling like having a bone broken to causing breathing problems, and more. Thankfully, puss caterpillars aren't so common that you're likely to encounter one. But if you're stung, act quickly by applying an ice pack and a therapeutic cream. You can look, but you better not touch. Number 16, Carnivorous Amazonian Centipede You wouldn't expect something with this name to be docile, would you? The Carnivorous Amazonian Centipede is the biggest centipede in the world, and it also has one of the biggest appetites. This insect grows as long as 14 inches. It also feasts on so many different kinds of animal species, including other insects, reptiles, and birds. Thanks to their potent venom, they can take down the likes of snakes and other creatures bigger than it. While these bites are extremely painful for humans, they usually aren't fatal. Nonetheless, we don't blame you for not planning any trips to the Amazon anytime soon. Number 15, Assassin Bug. Their spiny appearance can be intimidating, and for good reason. Assassin bugs, though safe to observe, should not be handled as their bites are said to be quite painful. While this insect's name is certainly scary, it's actually a bit of a misnomer. Assassin bug bites are very uncomfortable, but they aren't fatal, to humans at least. They stab other insects and animal species with sharp, curved beaks and let their venom do the rest of the work. They don't just go after insects that are directly bothering them, either. Assassin bugs are constantly on the move, looking for any and all prey. If you're a gardener, this is good news, because they stop vegetation enemies like caterpillars and aphids. Keep a good distance if you see an assassin bug, but let them be. They're providing pro bono security for your plants. Number 14, Goliath Beetle We don't know of any David beetles primed to take on this insect. The genus Goliathus contains five species, and they're all some of the biggest insects on the planet. These hulking black and white beetles live in African countries such as Liberia, Nigeria, and Ghana. They stay safe through their dense exoskeletons and forewings. They can also fly via a set of hind wings. Other evolutionary advantages include horns on the male beetles, useful for fighting enemies, and the female's heads, which they use for digging holes to lay their eggs in. Thankfully, they don't pose much of a threat to humans, though they can pinch with their mandibles if you get too close. Number 13, Hornets What's the difference between a hornet and a wasp? A hornet is actually a kind of wasp. If you've never faced a hornet's wrath, you're doing something right. These insects are big and bad, with stings that can be fatal, especially for people with allergies. They also tend to be bigger than other wasps, making them even more foreboding. You can identify a hornet's nest by its distinctive football-like shape. Don't want to be stung by a hornet. Leave them alone and they'll do the same for you. Still, it's hard to feel calm in the presence of these insects. Number 12, Praying Mantis. Praying mantises are beautiful insects that can be useful at helping rid gardens of invasive insects. However, they are also kind of terrifying, at least in terms of some mating rituals. Up to 28% of mantis mating rituals end with the male's head being devoured by the female. This is said to be more prevalent among mantises raised in captivity than ones in the wild, however. Their hunting skills are also enhanced by their quick reflexes, excellent vision, and ability to turn their heads without moving the rest of their bodies. Their eagerness to chow down on other creatures can have some drawbacks, though. They can end up going after insects and animals that are good for gardens, such as hummingbirds. Number 11, Flesh Flies. 
House flies aren't exactly sanitary insects, but they're downright dainty compared to flesh flies. If that name literally makes your skin crawl, wait till you hear that they like to breed in and dine on feces and rotting substances. Then, when it's time to give birth, they seek out open wounds to leave their maggots. So, if you need another good reason to bandage your cuts and scrapes, here it is. However, if you're in forensics, flesh flies are less disgusting and more useful. Their maggots can help murder investigations determine a time of death. Would forensic flies be a more generous handle? Number 10, Army Ants. Even the most experienced soldiers are no match for army ants. These insects are ruthless, taking down any creature or plant that gets in their way. This can be devastating for ecosystems. Army ants' ferocious jaws are sharp enough to not only consume humans but elephants as well. These ants, found in parts of Africa and Asia, display strength in numbers. A single colony can consist of around 20 million army ants. That helps explain why they can end the lives of 100,000 other creatures per day. We have one piece of advice about encountering army ants, retreat. Number 9, Giant Silkworm Assassin Caterpillar. Is this list changing your perception of caterpillars or what? The Giant Silkworm Assassin Caterpillar is an incredibly potent creature. Only found in South America, these caterpillars are also known as killer caterpillars and have been named as the most venomous caterpillar by Guinness World Records. Like other caterpillars, they have bristles for protection. However, theirs go an extra level, as these bristles are dangerously venomous. Once assassin caterpillars evolve into moths, however, this danger is gone. Still, it's better to be safe than sorry if you're ever tempted to handle an unfamiliar insect. Number 8, Tarantula Hawk. With a max length of 2 inches, the Tarantula Hawk may not be the largest insect on the list but it is certainly one of the gutsiest. Hooked legs and a stinger help these spider wasps prey on tarantulas. It's neither a tarantula nor a hawk. But it is plenty scary. These insects are known as spider wasps, and their targets are tarantulas. Specifically, it's the female tarantula hawks who do the hunting. First, they paralyze their victims by stinging them. Then, they bring them back to the nest where they lay one egg inside their eight-legged captive. The larva hatches soon after and feasts upon the still living tarantula. If you live in New Mexico, you might be familiar with the tarantula hawk, as it's the state insect. While their stings are very painful, they pose a minimal threat to humans. And if you don't bother tarantula hawks, they won't bother you. Number 7, Titan Beetle. As the name implies, these beetles are also a bit on the large size, growing as long as 6.5 inches. Native to South American rainforests, these beetles are incredibly fearsome. Their mandibles are so strong, they can break pencils. Don't get on a titan beetle's bad side, as they might bite into your skin to teach you a lesson. Titan beetles also warn enemies through hissing and find mates by flying and recognizing pheromones. Is that what they mean by love is in the air? Another fun fact, titan beetle larvae have never been discovered, though it's theorized the larvae consume wood for sustenance. Number 6, Camel Spider. This arachnid is also known as a wind scorpion. However, it's not quite a spider and not quite a scorpion. It is, however, quite a sight to behold, with its differently sized legs and prominent chelicera, which is its pincer-like jaws. This is great for helping them go after their prey, which includes insects like termites, as well as other animals, such as rodents and snakes. However, despite their name, they don't, as some myths insist, lay their eggs inside the stomachs of camels. Their name simply comes from their desert habitat. Oh, and they don't have any humps, either. Number 5, Botfly. We don't want to gross you out too much, but when it comes to unsettling insects, the butfly is something else. The larvae of these nightmare flies feast on their host's body from the inside. How do they get there? 
One way is by a female butterfly laying eggs directly on the host's body. However, they can also take a more convoluted path, laying their eggs in another parasite, such as a mosquito, who then spreads them to unsuspecting hosts. These hosts can then develop a condition known as myosis, which in extreme cases can require surgery to get rid of the flies. Hopefully, you never have any run-ins with bot flies. Number 4, Goliath Bird Eater. The name says it all. This truly gigantic tarantula is so large it has been known to eat entire birds. These rainforest inhabitants can have a leg span up to 11 inches, lifespan of up to 25 years, and will bite humans if threatened. You would be right to assume, based on its name, that this tarantula eats birds. However, these spiders, native to South America, tend not to favor birds for food. They got that reputation because of an 18th century engraving of one consuming a hummingbird. But there's still plenty more that's impressive about the Goliath bird eater. For one, it's the biggest spider in terms of mass. They also have an impressive set of fangs, great for making short work of prey. And if you're an adventurous eater, these spiders are edible, with a taste that's been compared to shrimp. Anyone in the mood for Goliath bird eater and grits? Number 3, Australian Funnel Web Spider. Australia is notorious for its creepy crawlers, but this one has to be the scariest. There are 35 different species in this spider family, some of which are venomous, and which have sometimes been fatal to humans. However, progress in anti-venom technology has made a major difference in surviving a funnel web spider bite. The development of immunoglobulin G antivenom in 1981 has essentially curbed deaths from these spiders. But these creatures are still plenty scary regardless. If you're ever hiking through the forest in Australia, be careful about turning over any rocks. And if anything happens, be sure to seek immediate medical attention. Number 2, Japanese Giant Hornet The Japanese Giant Hornet is a form of Asian Giant Hornet. You might have heard of these insects under a different name, Murder Hornets. That nickname exaggerates the extent of their threat to humans. However, they are still said to kill about 40 people in Japan annually. Asian giant hornets are the biggest hornets in the world, and while they're native to Asia, they've been found in parts of North America. Their long stingers inject a very painful venom, likened to having a searing hot nail go through your flesh. We're all for new experiences, but we'll pass on this one. From you make it this far in this video know it's time to see your number one. Number 1, Bullet Ant. There are many insects bigger than the bullet ant, including other ones on this list. However, these ants are terrifying at any size. Found in South and Central American rainforests, they might look like ordinary ants, but their stings distinguish them to a painful degree. This name isn't that much of an exaggeration. Being stung by a bullet is said to feel like being shot. Justin O. Schmidt, who created the Schmidt Sting Pain Index, compared it to walking over flaming charcoal with a 3-inch nail embedded in your heel. For making us even imagine that, this ant is number one, with a bullet. Thank you for watching.